Hey guys, what is up? The new Cubist here. Welcome to my new series. I'm going to be showing you guys how to build your plot and how I'm going to do my plot. This is the spawn of OP Anarchy. IP was in the beginning and it's also in the first line of the description. So if you guys want to come on and see my plot, you can come on OP Anarchy and you can do slash warp neo and it will take you to my official plot. And look, it's the beginnings of my plot. So, uh, I have a lot of plans for this. It's going to be sort of a tutorial type of series, and it's going to be really awesome because we're going to have to grind for certain materials, and I don't know, it's just going to be a lot, a lot of fun. So the first thing I wanted to do here was we are just going to start randomly breaking the ground, right? And we're just going to add gravel, and we're going to do this whole thing is sort of a, um, uh, I'm, not, I'm not really sure how to explain it, but all I'm going to do right now is something really boring, so I'm not going to record it, but I'm gonna, just going to randomly break some grass, and then we are just going to place gravel in those holes. Then we're going to take some cobblestone stairs and uh, full-size pieces of cobblestone and place them in everywhere else. So I'm going to go ahead and break all this. I'm going to come right back. So I figure while I'm breaking the last few blocks, I'm going to sort of explain myself here and explain what's going on. So I'm on a server called OP Anarchy. Again, IP is in the first line of the description and the beginning of the video if you guys want to see it visually. This is a OP prison server, which means it's like normal prison, but everything's just 10 times more fun and it's a lot quicker. Um, it's just a really awesome server. It's a really awesome guy. Uh, 75 plus players online at all times. The owner actually cares about the server. Uh, he's not 100% about money, which means you can actually play it without donating. But if you want to donate, there are some really, really awesome perks to that. So come on and check it out. But yes, so... Um, I'm going to be doing just a tutorial series on a prison server. It's going to be fun because we'll have to grind to different, uh, you know, different mines and stuff for the uh, ranks to get different blocks and whatnot. So if I, let's say, need glowstone, and that's, I think someone said it was on like warp Q or something, that means I'm going to have to grind all the way to warp Q to get the uh, block I need, which is going to be really fun for you guys, and it's going to be fun for me also, and it'll be fun for you guys to come on and build your plot and hopefully... Uh, the first few couple of you might actually get a plot next to mine, which would be quite interesting. And, uh, yeah, it'd be awesome, because you guys could just come on here, come look at my, uh, look at my plot in-game, right? And just do a tutorial based off of that, and I thought, you know, that'd be really cool for you guys. And I thought recording on a server and doing tutorials like that would be the best, because then you guys can sort of interact with me in-game, and I'll be in here a lot doing stuff. And I don't know, it'll be, it'll, it'll just be boatloads of fun for both you and me, and I really wanted you guys to be a part of that. So basically what I'm doing at this point is I'm just filling in the random holes I broke with gravel, and the reason I'm doing this is because eventually I'm going to go get cobblestone and stuff, and you can do slash shop, and there's awesome shops. I love how this server's set up, it's just so amazing. It's just also clean, the website's awesome, it's a really cool portal and stuff, just go check it out. Links are all in the description below. Um, so, oh, this is so fun, but... Anyways, I'm going to fill all these up in BRB. Yeah, just finishing up the last few pieces. Oh, God, I realized I missed the middle. And it's turning dark, so you guys can't see. But one thing about this server that I like is it's a 24-7 dedicated server. So there's absolutely no lag. It can't be hit offline with DDoSs. They have some custom scripting in there just to prevent any sort of DDoS attacks from actually getting through the system. So you, all your stuff's always going to be online. It's a super reliable guy. It's a fresh restart on the server, so the server's just now starting back up, which is awesome. Which means you guys are going to have a lot of fresh new content. And what's cool is the staff actually cares, right? The staff is actually online helping people, showing people how to do stuff. Unlike a lot of servers where I think, you know, the staff is sort of full of themselves and they really don't care about the players. But yes, anyways, we have filled everything up with gravel, so we are going to do slash warp A which is the first uh, rank of prison. And these prison mines are awesome. All custom, fully built. They're really, really cool. Again, guys, I know I'm pushing this hard, but seriously, you should come on and check it out. Hopefully you guys like it as much as I do. I'm not, you know, playing it just for the prison aspect. I'm actually playing it so I can do tutorials for you guys, which I think is awesome. Basically, what I'm doing is I'm just getting the materials through prison, and I'm just doing tutorials. And I thought that'd be really fun because you guys want a, you know, sort of Let's Play series from me. I want to do tutorials so I can do, you know, a Let's Tutorial series, which I did have before, but this is going to be a little bit different. It's on a server, and you guys can join in with me and build and come on my plot. Again, you can just do slash warp neo, and you're at my plot. But obviously, there's nothing really there yet, but uh, eventually there will be. So I'm just going to collect wood here for probably, like, Oh, see, look at all the people online. That's awesome. 116 players online right now. But, yes, so I have... I didn't even press that. I have a little bit of wood right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to keep collecting some wood, grind for some wood. 
and I am going to come right back when I have a boatload of wood, and we're going to get started on the outer wall of our plot. So yeah, see you guys then. Also, uh, while I'm getting this and just thinking of things, is even if you're not on the PC, right, and you can't do this, what's cool about this series is it's like a tutorial, right? So you guys can still build this on Pocket Edition, you can still build it on Xbox, PS Vita, whatever other platform you're on, you guys can still watch this, follow along with me, enjoy my absolutely just 100% interesting personality. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm not, well, I, I don't know, but... You guys can follow along and just still do the builds because there's going to be a lot of new houses and stuff in this. There's going to be some farms, animal farms, there's going to be normal farms, wheat farms, a lot of, you know, houses, uh, just different things that are going to look really awesome. We're going to have a lot of underground portions to this, so it's going to be really big underground. And I don't know, I just have a lot of things planned for this and I feel like it's going to be really, really awesome. And I'd love for you guys to come on and play with me and check it out on OP Anarchy. See, I'm still... I'm still just getting wood, so I have a decent amount of wood. I'm going to wait till I have about two stacks of each type, which is uh, not too close right now. So again, I'm just going to cut the recording and come right back. It'll be a second for you guys, probably like 10 minutes for me, so that's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. It's the magic of the F12 button. Look what happened. Someone dug a hole straight down. Cute girl gamer 03. Dug a go <laughs> just dug a hole and now I'm stuck underground, which is kind of funny. But uh, as I was thinking, like... Basically, it's kind of like a survival series in a, in a way, you know, hear me out here I know it's not like it at all But in a way it's somewhat like a survival series in the fact that all I'm doing is gathering materials Via these prisons instead of me finding a bunch of trees and just mining them and that that's no fun, right? Like you guys don't want to see me mine trees you guys don't want to see me mine this So all this is is like it's like an avenue for me to get you guys awesome builds show you tutorials on them and play on a server so you guys can come on and play with me and see them. So I just, I don't know, I, I thought a lot about this and I figured you guys would want to do something like this. And uh, I figured you guys would want to come on and check it out. And again, even if you can't come on and play with me, you can still watch the series 100%. And all you have to do is just follow the builds. By the way, the plots are 33 by 33. So if you're copying me exactly, go ahead and designate an area that is 33 by 33. So yeah, I don't really even know how much I've dug here. I haven't really checked my inventory in quite a while. So I have one stack of oak wood. So like, oh gosh, see, I have like every type of wood. So that's why it's taking so long. That's funny. But yes, I'm going to press F12 again. I know I keep cutting in and out, but I just, I have all these thoughts and I want to share them with you in the first episode. So you guys sort of know where the direction of this series is going and how it's going to be. All right, so finally done collecting uh, wood. And something that's really cool, right? is another thing you can grind for is you can do, not shops, you can do slash shop, you can open this up and you can do all these categories, really awesome, you just click on like blocks and you can buy some oak leaves, right, those are $60,000, so right now I have $36,000, but all I have to do is just grind and mine some of this stuff, go over there, right click on that, sell my whole inventory, get another 36 grand, and then I can buy 16 of those oak leaves and use them on my plot, so that's really cool, hopefully, uh, not warp, eight, warp neo, hopefully eventually, oh, it's still... Oh, yes, that's perfectly timed. All right, we got to film this, boys. We got to film it. Oh, the sunrise on OP Anarchy. All right, so let's get started on this. So I'm going to go ahead and open one of these chests, and I'm just going to throw in everything in here I don't need currently. And we're going to get to work on this outer wall. So I think for this wall, specifically, I'm going to focus on birch wood and maybe some dark oak. That is, those look almost, are the, I don't want to know. I'm going to use spruce. Oh, where's the dark oak? I'm going to use dark oak, and I'm going to use birch for this um, wall outside around here. So now all I'm going to do is I'm just going to craft a bunch of dark oak planks, and uh, I'm going to leave the birch how it is. And now we're going to make a bunch of fences. So the funny thing is, uh, when we're making sticks, we're going to use another type of wood we're probably never going to use, this jungle wood. So let's just go ahead and make a butt ton of these. And did you know a boatload is actually a real measurement? I think it's like 2.3 barrels of wine. I actually heard that from a friend in school who sits next to me in U.S. history. And if you're watching this, that's crazy. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and craft these fences now. I don't remember 100% how the recipe is because they changed it recently. So if I get it wrong at first, nope, see? <laughs> if I get it wrong at first, don't, don't hate, don't hate, please. Alright, that's fences. So we are going to need a couple of fences, nothing extreme, probably like a stack, maybe two stacks. Uh, yeah, maybe just two stacks should be good for now. Again, I'm going to show you guys how I'm doing all of this, so it's going to be pretty awesome. 
I hope to get a lot done in the first episode too, so you guys aren't like, well, why would I come on to see it if there's nothing done? So I'm gonna try to get a lot done. We're gonna craft a bunch of stairs, we're gonna craft a bunch of these slabs. So, you guys are gonna get to see me come up with a design live on air, which should be pretty fun. So we already do have this one wall, right? So I'm thinking, as a base layer, we're gonna do one type of uh, block all the way around. We should use a type of wood that's not going to be used anywhere else. We don't need all these sticks in our inventory now. Just realized that. I don't know why I made so many sticks, but we'll use them in the future for sure. And this is all temporary right here, obviously. We'll have a storage house and everything. So this acacia wood we're going to want to make into, into these. And now we're just going to put it in our inventory. And we're going to go all the way around with our acacia wood. And we're just going to place it like this all the way around. So we have a base for the wall, which should be fun. So I'm not going to film this because... That would be poker eyes out with a flaming stick boring. So, no bueno. And I'm done. All right, cool. So we have this entire thing all the way around our plot, and that's going to be the base for our wall. So you guys are gonna get to see me some make some live ideas straight, live on the air, sort of on the air. So this is odd, right? So we're gonna take these birch wood, and we're gonna take these birch wood, and we're going to do a three space in between. So we're gonna do one, one, two, three, one. One, two, three, one, one, two, three. Thing is, I know these are 33 by 33, but I don't actually know if this is gonna line up correctly. And if it doesn't, then I'm just gonna have to cut the recording and just one, two, three. Yes, yes, thank you for making odd plot sizes, whoever decided to do that. That is amazing, I love you. All right, so we're gonna make these uh, too high for now. Probably, they, they might be a little bit higher in the future, not 100% sure. But again, this is just gonna be a wall around this, and that's gonna be the entrance. So I'm gonna leave that one down. So we're gonna wanna do something there. So again, all I'm doing is just making these birch things one higher. So now they're too high. And I think on top of them, we're going to take a doak arc, a doak arc slab. Yep, that's what they're called. And we're going to place the doak arc slabs on top of each one of these little birch wood pillars. Right there, we'll do a cool entrance so you guys can come in and out of the plot nice and easy. So there we go. And now I'm going to do that. I'm just going to repeat that on all four sides now. Actually, no, I, I'm going to actually make this wall design before I do that so I don't end up with some weird designs. So now I'm going to put a stair. Yep, see, I'm just I'm butchering everything. I'm going to put a stair in between all these. It's actually a dark oak fence, which I think looks quite nice. And then we are going to take our dark oak wood slabs. And again, if you guys don't have these specific types of wood, all you have to do is just substitute it for another type. You know, there's nothing to... Nothing to get mad at me about or mad at anyone about. So that's all I'm going to do, really. I'm just placing one... Oh my goodness. I'm placing one here, one below it, and then one up. And I'm just going to do that everywhere around this plot now. So this is probably going to take a while. And I'm probably going to have to go get more stuff. But hey, it's for the YouTubes. Do it for the YouTubes. All right. I will be right back in a second with all of this wall done. Okay, so I hope I can do this one recording. As I uh, placed all these, I'm doing sort of a parkour thing, and I'm placing these as I go, and it's really cool. No! <laughs> See, I messed up, but it's really fun to do that. I th you guys should try that and make me watch you as you parkour your logs on the your arc doke slabs or whatever I call it. See, I messed up. I messed up. That was so cool, and I messed up. Oh, no. So disappointing. All right, let me finish this wall real quick. So yeah, guys, I mean, I don't think I've ever had this much fun in Minecraft in a long time. I mean, to be honest, I, I do enjoy doing the builds and tutorials for you guys, but I, I haven't, I, the reason I'm not doing a survival Let's Play is I just can't do it, right? It's not very fun for me, and I didn't want to make you guys sit through something I wasn't really truly enjoying. But this, I'm actually enjoying it, and it's awesome because there's 36 mines to progress through, and there's 25 prestiges. And it's just really, really cool. And again, guys, just warp Neo to get here. So I finished the wall all the way around. I think it turned out quite beautifully. We'll figure out something to do with this bottom layer. But you can't get in from the inside and you can't get out from the inside. And I guess this is the center right here. So we're going to go ahead and break an area here. We're going to do a cool little entrance. So I can't break these blocks, but mm, you know what? Let's ask the owner. Let's see if he can break them. Look at that. Look at the owner actually helping. That's awesome. Thank you very much. Thank you. So yeah, that's pretty cool, having an owner help you who actually cares about the server. Anyways, um, what I'm doing right now is I'm going to, uh, and by the way, guys, uh, you know, n nothing really bad happened with Parallax MC. It just, it, it wasn't working. You know, the, we thought the server was going to grow and get big and just, it, it didn't go anywhere. And I'm, st I'm still friends with the people. We're still on good terms, but 
you know, it was time to move on for me and for them. So we're gonna do sort of a master entrance here, right? So, well, one, two, three. This is one above and this is one above. That's cool. So now we need to decide how we're going to do this entrance. So I feel like I need to get back up there. So I'm gonna, uh, I'll place these. Uh, we're gonna get back up here. We're gonna do one in, then we're gonna do one up, and then we're gonna go over. So in, up, over. In, up, over. Cool, cool. Now we're gonna take some of these stairs we have. We're gonna place them right there. And then we're just gonna do that. And we're gonna place one right there too. And that should do for a cool entrance as of there. And then we're gonna place two stairs here. And now we have the entrance to our build, which is quite awesome in my opinion. I'm gonna go ahead and just put some stairs up here. Cause I feel like that would be cool. Maybe even right there. Something like this, like, like, like a castle, you know how they have those those things, right? Like, I don't know. Maybe not that, but I don't know. I, I think we'll just leave it for, uh, leave these fences for aesthetic's sake. I think that looks the best. All right, cool. I think the first thing we should do, first uh, order of ordinance here is we need a chest room, because this, uh, this equals no bueno. Uh, we can do above ground or underground, but unfortunately, guys, it is time for me to end the episode. It's been going on for quite a while, and yep, I think it's a good cliffhanger point. So tell me in the comment section below right now, should I do an above ground chest room or an underground chest room tutorial on this plot? Which one do you guys want to see? Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're enjoying this series, please leave a like. If you're not enjoying it, leave a dislike and tell me in the comment section below why you are not enjoying it. Be sure to follow me on Twitter. You can send me the picture of your plot or any of your builds on your plot. And be sure to come on the server. I'm going to throw the IP on the screen right now. And boom, there's the IP. And I'll even type it right here. Look at this. OP anarchy.com really easy ip the ip is in the first uh line in the description and everything so yeah if you guys are new to my channel and you'd like to see more content like this and a lot of tutorials click that subscribe button not sure if this will attract new people but i know my subscribers will love this anyways thank you guys so so much for watching i hope to see you on the server i'll see you guys in the next episode bye